Can I tell you a secret? I've saved my clients hundreds of thousands of dollars per year and saved time over the years and discovered there is only one concept you need. It's really easy and fast to adopt and could save you from internal chaos in your business without needing any new tools or apps. So today I'm going to show you how to avoid the number one mistake most businesses make with Microsoft 365, how to easily fix the chaos in your business, how to start getting in total clarity in minutes with no tech skills needed. To start, let me show you why most people completely misunderstand how Microsoft 365 is meant to work and how this one mistake causes nearly all of the chaos you're experiencing. Think of your Microsoft 365 setup as a physical office space. Each major asset, like a SharePoint site or a Microsoft team, which creates its own SharePoint site behind the scenes, is like its own separate office building. Each building has its own locked doors. Now imagine you have dozens of these buildings. Suddenly, no one knows exactly where to go. Where do they find their colleagues to collaborate? Which building holds their latest files? They've even forgotten where they left their own important documents. Wasting valuable time searching through multiple locations. If you've structured your Microsoft environment purely by department or project, thinking about security first, you've unintentionally created chaos. Everyone ends up isolated in their own little silos, but that's not how modern businesses actually operate. Real world processes cross departmental lines, projects are multifunctional by nature. And here's the thing, your security actually becomes weaker, not stronger. Employees inevitably start working around the barriers you've created, resorting to WhatsApp, Teams chat, personal Google drives, or Dropbox because the Microsoft environment you set up doesn't support the way they actually need to work. But how do you fix this chaos and transform your Microsoft 365 into a streamlined productivity machine? One that saves your organization hundreds of thousands of dollars in wasted time. Well, let me show you exactly how we solve this for a recent client. When they came to us, they faced a familiar challenge. Projects scattered across email, WhatsApp, Dropbox, and OneDrive. They had more teams and channels than actual employees. And they just spent eight months building a SharePoint intranet, hoping it would fix everything. But it didn't. Everyone was working hard, but no one was working together. Here's what we did instead. We simplified their digital workspace down to one clear, consistent team structure. Almost overnight, collaboration improved dramatically. By choosing just one tool for each specific purpose and using it consistently, people finally knew exactly what to do. When it was due, everything was responsible. They stopped wasting time asking, where's that file? And started actually getting work done. So how can you achieve this clarity in your own organization quickly, easily, and without advanced technical skills? Well, here's the simple proven framework we use to get results fast. Step one, begin with just one Microsoft team for your entire organization. This automatically creates a clear SharePoint site behind the scenes. Only create additional teams if there's a genuine privacy need, usually such as finance or HR. Step two, set up as few channels as possible. Aim for around five to 10 people per channel. Too many channels create confusion about where to find things. If there's ever uncertainty about where something belongs, you've already made it too complicated. Simplicity takes effort, but it's worth it. Start small and add more, only if you truly need them. Step three, decide on a clear, consistent naming convention for your conversations. For example, use project numbers or client names and titles to make searching and discovery easy. Choose a simple, repeatable system that fits your workflow. Step four, keep your file and folder structure as flat as possible. Remember, the channel itself is already the first folder. Avoid deep folder hierarchies that slow people down and confuse them. And step five, be crystal clear on which Microsoft app you'll use for each function. For example, choose planner or list for tasks, loop or OneNote for notes, SharePoint or Teams first for communication. Pick just one per use case. Go all in and refine as you go. Avoid overlap at all costs. In short, you're creating a digital version of an open plan office, clear, open, and intuitive. This simplifies training and adoption because everything's already clearly defined and easy to use. It also simplifies governance and security 
There's no need for complicated processes because your structure is already clear and intuitive. Ultimately, this framework is about one thing, making your employees' lives easier so they can focus on meaningful work instead of wasting time. But if you don't tie this into simplifying your processes at the same time that you layer in more technology, then it will all fall apart and people will just go packed doing what they used to do. So either book a call to work together or watch this next video and I'll show you how to streamline your business with Microsoft 365 and get it to stick.